guys, what? Xanta Corey here, and uh, today I am going to uh, show you how to define a key. This can help you a lot while you're scripting because you can set things as other things. Take note, I'm going to define in as slash n, long slash, slash n. Now, that is going to create a new line, if you didn't know what that did. That creates a new line. Uh, so, watch. C out. Hello, world. How are you? It's like a tree hugger. Um, N. Capital N. And then put that. C out. Oh, I am doing just dandy. Is that you spell dandy? I don't know. I don't care. I don't think there is any proper spelling for dandy. File, save. Compile and run. Now you can see that created two separate lines. Now, if we did not have those ends, it would look like this. So I can just show you that it worked. It wasn't some fluke. What I do? Failed errors. What? Don't, don't give me that crap. There's no build error. Is there? No. Yeah, sure, go ahead. Okay. On the contrary to it looking like that. Which looks like crap because you don't even know what's going on. Hello world, how are you? Oh, well, I'm doing just Andy. Please press any key to continue. Um, I don't know exactly what happened with that whole thing, but if that ever happens, just go up to uh, debug, and it will just fix it for you. I don't know what was wrong because I can see it didn't even change anything. I don't know what happened. Maybe I'll find it later. But uh, that is how you define keys. Um, you can define almost anything. Uh, so that's tutorial 4 for you. Next tutorial, I don't know. Um, where's my recorder? Here it is. This is Exanta Cory signing out.